I'll tell you, there's a lot of fun sites that we don't think of when we think of going to Italy or France or Paris or, 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 or Spain. Uh, and you've got a lot of things that, that might be interesting to you that don't come up on the, on the top ten sites in each town. It's important for you to understand what sites are available and then study aggressively before your trip so you know where they are. Sometimes they're little private little fancies. I mean, you don't go around saying you love human bones, but just between you and me, you'd love to see thousands of bones stacked neatly in a crypt. Well, then you need to know the word capuchin. Because when you go to the capuchin crypt, and there are several, you'll find all the bones you'll ever want. Okay? If you're into the beetles, if you're into dogs, if you're into thimbles, if you're into shoes, you know, if you're into chocolate, there's a museum for you. And that's the fun thing in your travels. Find those museums. The museums are excellent, and they really, really make your trip sparkle. I'll warn you, the typical tourist comes into a town without a guidebook, and their top sites are what's advertised on the main street. Here we are in Amsterdam. The majority of the visitors to Amsterdam think of these sites as the must-see sites. Why? Because they're right there advertised at the train station, in the hotel lobby, on the main drag. What do you have? Madame Tussauds, Body Works, the Ice Bar, the Dungeon, and the Heineken Experience. Where's the Rijksmuseum? Where's Anne Frank? Where's the Dutch Resistance? Where's Van Gogh? Those are not big commercial ventures. These are commercial ventures. No cabbie, no concierge, no, no hotelier, no, no, uh, nobody gets a kickback when they send you to uh, Anne Frank's or the Rijksmuseum. You get a huge kickback when you talk people into spending 20 bucks to see this. So remember, the information that comes to you is not always the information that you want. Again, we work very hard. I've got 100 people that work with me at Rick Steves Europe, and our whole mantra is content, content, content. Generate great content. There's more than enough information out there. We want to curate that information, design it, and make sure that you know how to get the best, the very best out of every mile, minute, and dollar in your upcoming vacation.